Hi, this is Alina, and today I wanted to share a workout that would help those of you who may struggle with low motivation. You're just gonna need a box or a bench, access to a timer, and some dumbbells. The most important piece here is to remember that baby steps are the key. I love this workout because it incorporates the most powerful tool of all time. <laughs> Whenever I struggle with low motivation, I try my very best to, to remember the reasons why it's so healthy for me to move my body and why it matters to me the most. Then I tell myself, I only have to do this for 10 minutes, 20 minutes, 30 minutes, you fill it in. But today we're just going to do 10 minutes. It's very important for you to feel like you're doing small steps or creating building blocks so that the next time you feel like it is very doable. So here we go. Go ahead and get set up. Set your timer for 10 minutes. Minute one, we're going to complete one air squat or box squat, one push up, one dumbbell row each side, and then one jump or jumping jack. I'll explain what these look like, but just so you know, the minute two, then you're going to increase two squats, two push ups, two rows, two jumping jacks or jumps, three minutes, three reps, so on and so forth. So for the air squats, you want to keep your knees below your toes and your hips below your knees. You also want to keep your chest high and keep your core muscles very tight. This is a great movement for both strength and cardio. If you need to scale it, um, you can barbell on your back if you need, need to make it heavier or just double the reps. Do whatever you need to do to make it work. Okay, so the push-ups, you can do them on the ground, or if you want to scale them, find an elevated surface and set up there. You want to keep your arms about shoulder width apart, keep your core nice and tight, and your hips tucked. You don't want to raise your butt up high or have your hips up too high. This, um, that will really uh, put more pressure on your shoulders. And this exercise is awesome for building upper body strength. For the dumbbell rows, this is another great way to build excitement around the exercise because you can increase weight fairly quickly. You can start with five pounds or 10 pounds each side or try to have some other options for yourself available. This will create a great sense of accomplishment. You wanna place your hand on the bench, flatten your back and keep your arm close to your side. Bring the weight up to your chest area and point your elbow towards the ceiling. Do one on each side. Here, you're gonna be building upper back strength, shoulder strength, I love this exercise. Lastly, the vertical jump or jumping jack. You wanna bend down like you're squatting and then reach as high as you can with your hands as you jump up. This builds um, muscle strength as well as explosive power. You're also gonna get a great cardio workout. You know, for the jumping jack, it's fun and will take you back to being little again. You wanna start with your hands at your sides. You wanna bring your arms up, come together, bring your legs out, clap your hands, and then bring everything back and then repeat. They're honestly great cardio and the more in a row that you do. So once you get to minute five, you wanna continue the ladder up if you feel like you can keep up with the minute or go back down. The best part of the workout is it hits your entire body and this workout builds on itself. Typically, for those of us who struggle with low motivation it has a lot to do with energy but the catches exercise and movement have a lot to do with bringing energy back so you'll be done this workout in 10 minutes and before you know it know it i hope that you find it fun i enjoy these types of workouts where you just set the timer and you go it is helping you be able to increase small steps which will also help motivation a couple other quick benefits you're going to increase blood flow to the brain bringing oxygen there you're going to be contracting muscles which is helping manage blood sugar. You're also stimulating endorphins, which makes you feel amazing. <laughs> if you're feeling good, I advise you to go out for like a 10 minute walk, get some sunshine with you can, if you can, but if not, you're done for the day. Thanks for joining me for this workout to help with motivation.